Today's video is on Poisson distribution. In today's video, we are going to discuss a problem that is wireless sets are manufactured with 25 soldered joints each. See here, the number of joints are 25. N is given as 25. On the average, one joint in 500 is defective. So, among 500, one is defective. Here, the probability P is equal to 1 by 500 and whereas N is equal to 25. How many sets can be expected to be free from defective joints in a consignment of 10,000 sets? So, this is the question and it's very clear that N is given as 25 and P is given as 1 by 500 and we have to find out that how many sets can be expected to be free from the defective joints in a consignment of 10,000 sets. And let's get started to solve this. See here, on average, one joint in 500 is defective. P is equal to 1 by 500. And see, the number of soldered joints from the question here is 25. So, N is equal to 25. So, first of all, we have to calculate the mean value. Mean is equal to N into P. What is N? That is 25. And mean is equal to, this is 1 by 500. If I cancel in 25 table, this is 20. So, lambda is equal to 1 by 20. Whereas, lambda is equal to, this is 0 0.05. So, this is the value of lambda. So, after getting the lambda, we have to find out that how many cents can be expected to be free from defective joints in a consignment of 10,000 sets. See, here I am using Poisson distribution. So, in Poisson distribution, we have a formula ready that probability of, see here, probability of x is equal to r is equal to e power minus lambda, lambda power r by r factorial. r factorial here, just now, r lambda value is nothing but 0 0.05. See here, 1 by 20. The value of lambda here is so, see here, the value of lambda is 0 0.05. And now, see here, what is the probability that we get the sets can be expected to be free from defective? See, we have to find out the probability that they are 0, 0 number of defective items. So, R is equal to 0 defective items, free from defective. Free from defective means here R is equal to 0. So, if R is equal to 0, see here, if R value is equal to 0, then what will be the value? So, E power minus lambda. Lambda is equal to minus 0 0.05 and this is 0 0.05 power 0 by 0 factorial. So, if it is free from defective items means we have to take R value as 0. And see, here, the value is equal to, see, r is equal to 0 here. So, if r is equal to 0, anything to the power of 0 is 1 and 0 factorial is again equal to 1. So, this is nothing but 0 0.05, minus 0 0.05. Therefore, the expected number of, see here, the expected number of sets free of defective, joints free of defective joints among 10,000 sets among 10,000 sets is equal to this value is 10,000 into e power minus 0 0.05 the value here that is it's 10,000 10,000 into, see here, this value is 0 0.951229. So, this is equal to 9512.29. So, which is approximately equal to 9512. Therefore, the expected number of the sets free from defective joints among 10,000 is 9512. So, this is the value and this is how we have to solve so, if you understand the question, it's very, very easy to solve. A wireless sets are manufactured with 25 soldered joints each. So, N is equal to 25. On the average, one joint in 500 is defective. P is equal to 1 by 500. And after getting N in P, 
so this is the lambda value lambda is equal to n into p lambda is equal to 0 0.05 and next what is it is asked how many sets can be expected to be free from defective joints so the probability that they are zero defective items is equal to here r is equal to zero and lambda is equal to 0 0.05 and this is the formula for Poisson distribution. So after substituting this is the value and therefore the expected number of the sets free from defective joints among 10,000 sets is equal to 10,000 into this one probability of excess r is equal to 0 and therefore we got 9,512 non-defective items. Thank you so much for watching.